What have we got here? So here, this is one of the few um, standalone products that we do. It's climolytic tropo uh, rain gauge. We've got the uh, we've got the funnel here. Three hundred. Three hundred. Yeah. So the beauty of it is you've got the funnel, mm -hmm. which sits on the top. And so your rain drops into that, and it fills up the um, the internal cylinder, mm -hmm. which is obviously uh, down to uh, what do we go up to twenty five millimeters. Mm -hmm. A lot of people say, oh, well, when that fills up, what happens? Well, the clever thing with it is, and this is the cute stuff, is that when the uh, internal funnel fills up, mm -hmm. it then overflows to the outer funnel. Mm -hmm. So what you can do is you obviously take that and, uh, and you're going to tip that out uh, and you're going to go, right, I've got my 25 millimetres. Mm -hmm. And then you've emptied that out and then you pour that into that. Mm -hmm. So you can get all your collected water in there, but obviously what most people would do would be looking at this on a daily basis. Yeah. So it comes with its own, um, its own little chart. Mm -hmm. So you've got some little spikes. So if we put that back in there like so. This filter. Yeah, this, this, yeah. this sits on the top like that. And then you've got spikes, there you go, that go all the way around the top. Mm -hmm. So that's gonna stop any uh, birds sitting on the top and basically fouling it up. You've also got a really useful uh, carrying handle on it. Mm -hmm. um, and a little bracket here. So your bracket here, that screws to a, like a post or something like that. Mm -hmm. And then, simply enough, this just, uh, this just slots on um, onto, the, onto the post. Um, it then comes with its own uh, really handy little uh, cleaning, um, cleaning device here. So if it gets green, you can just give it a scrub out to keep it level or to, to get it level to start with. It actually comes with, you've got a little, uh, you've got a little spirit bubble. Now it's quite easy to assemble. Yep. What are the uses for this? Mainly rainfall. I mean, it's also it's also completely weather, weatherproof. Mm -hmm. So they're designed for it's an American design. So I think these are designed to like work in like really cold temperatures, sort of down to mm -hmm. minus twenties. Mm -hmm. So obviously, then what happens is when the snow melts, then it will just uh, then it will just turn into your water, and then you can measure how much how much uh, water you've had then. Mm -hmm. um, so really, um, some people some people are using. You know, we've got farms using them that really yeah. just want a rain gauge. These are around about the eighty pound mark. Mm -hmm. um, use it in the Garden, in the back so, garden, yeah. so you know, an, an, an ideal Christmas present or birthday present for mm -hmm. that uncle or the or parent, you know, that you don't know what to get, but that's always talking about the weather. Where would you recommend this to go? In, in a backyard, you're going to want to put it as as open as possible mm -hmm. um, on a, on a post or a pole, mm -hmm. and then you're looking about ideally two and a half to three feet above grass. Right. That's the ideal height. Yeah. You don't want to put it anywhere where you're going to get any shadow from the rain. So if you've got a big tree over here, and obviously if the rain's coming from this direction, then you're going to get what's called a rain shadow. Mm -hmm. If you put it too low to the ground and it's on a hard surface, mm -hmm. you can actually get really heavy rain mm -hmm. and it will splash back into it. We call that splashback. So, mm -hmm. And there's a, there's a guide to where you, where you fit them. Yeah. Um, and it's very simple, you know, within 10 minutes, you can have that up and running. Mm -hmm. um, and then you can just keep using your records and, and away you go. For example, if you're in farming, it's mm. really useful to be able to tie in how much rainfall you've had mm. to maybe your crop growth. Yeah. Or if you've had really heavy rain and then you've got some damage, you can go, well, okay, well, we had, you know, we had 25, 30 millimetres of rain today. Mm. That's kind of why we're, we're, we're wet. Mm. Um, from somebody that's just doing it as a hobby, people yeah. really like to go back with on their, on their rainfall records. Yeah. You'll, pe you'll see people maybe keep that on a sheet or they'll keep it on an Excel spreadsheet. Mm. And, and we've, had, we've had people ring up, you know, that we've been keeping manual records for the last... 70 years, oh, wow. you know, that, that yeah. oh, my father did it and I've yeah. done it. Um, I guess it's a hobby as well. It is a hobby for some people. Yeah. You would lift it off the post and then you put it onto there and then you've got clips on. Very nice. Either that or a very big coffee mug. Yeah. <laughs>